So, uh, what's the plan? Well, I found the cave Herr Cool spoke of, and also a guide. She's up ahead. I think we can trust her. Follow me. The entrance is along here. Just watch your footing. So, uh, what do we do when we get Javier? Back? Well, uh, we're gonna get the hell out of here. And set sail for the one place. Ain't nobody gonna be expecting us. Uh, uh, get everybody together. And get ourselves back on course. Where would that be? Place we just escaped from. <laughs> you want to go back to Sandini? If it was you got left, you'd want us to go back. I'd want it, but I wouldn't expect That's it. That's the point. Ain't no one gonna expect it. We come back from the dead, gather everyone, and we leave before anyone realizes we've even resurrected. An insect bite you or something? Cause you gone, friend. We look like what we are. A bunch of desperados on the run. But with the women, a change of clothes, <laughs> we're a choir or a gang of pilgrims or something. Whatever you say. A bunch of penniless fugitives on some Caribbean dump. Sneaking through caves while two of our best men got shot back home. How could I doubt you, Dutch? You got no idea, Arthur. No idea at all. I will do whatever it takes for us to survive. I guess that's what I'm afraid of. Hold on. Why? Gloria! Ay, estás tarde. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Dinero, the money, the gold. A key. Damelo. Oh, it's genuine, yo old hag. <gasps> vamos, vamos, rápido. Now that gold right there, that's the last bit of gold I have in my pocket from the bank. The rest of it is at the bottom of the sea. Exactly. You know, wasn't Fusar one of the feathers Bronte pointed out to us at the party in San Denis? Yeah, you're right. I knew I'd heard that name before. Yeah. So I met up with Leon. That situation with the workers is dealt with. Captured. Tied up, beaten. Poor bastards. No, oh, that was me. Are you sure this her Q fellers ain't just using us? Almost certainly. But he's the best chance we have right now of getting out of this place. Won't be long before someone figures out who we are and sends word to the U.S. So what happened with John in that bank? He survived. Unlike dear Hosea and Lenny. The only one they took alive. Why is that, you think? I don't know. I was already on the roof. I didn't see it. And Abigail, I presume she was able to slip away in time. What are you talking about? You know, when I look back at all the chaos of the past few weeks, the apparent superficial chaos, I begin to wonder, maybe, for somebody, this is all going exactly to plan. I still ain't sure what you're saying, Dutch. Puede callarse ya. Estamos cerca. The door is stuck. You'll have to lift it. Pardon me, my queen. <clears throat> Arthur, come help me with this. Just lift it. Okay, then. Oh, that's it. Very good, sir. Aquí. Aquí arriba. 
This way. See, then you pay more. Okay. More. Just a second. Pay more. Pay now. Dutch, what are you doing? Oh, Jesus. Easy, Dutch. What was that? Horrible old crone. But you killed her. She was gonna betray us, Arthur. Couldn't you tell? No. Well, I got some Spanish. She was. You keep killing folk, Dutch. I am just trying to make sure that some of us survive, Arthur. Now, shall we proceed? I guess. Listen, <clears throat> son. You think I want any of this? I don't know. Of course I don't. But I made a pledge to you all. We would survive. No matter what. So how did you know she was gonna betray us? What'd she say? It was in her eyes, in the way she was leading us. But you said you knew Spanish. I know human beings. Arthur. <laughs> Are you gonna strangle me next? I'm doing the best I can. I come from Mexico. I never met those men. Does anyone believe him? Oh. Mr. Simon doesn't believe you. Even the mule doesn't believe you. Eso ni fue para tanto. Si que deja de actuar. Sabemos que no estuvo tan fuerte. Fue bastante duro. No. La próxima vez será aún más duro. Bueno. Ha sido un placer. Siempre me encantaron los mexicanos. Vamos, carajo. ¿Qué hacemos This way. They're all listening to that fool. They won't notice us if we stay quiet. We need to deal with them. Well, I'm sure you got some ideas. Shut up and help me kill them. On my count, you take the one on the right. I'll take the left. Okay, let's hide the bodies. You grab that one. Over here. Let's head around the back of the building and see if we can find a way through. Let's go in there. Uh, well, you know me, Arthur will cause ourselves a little distraction and then poof, we will disappear. Take the other side of this door. Ni es una civilización, un país civilizado. Me podía costar como mujeres que usan zapatos. Tienes algo de tomar? ¿Cómo sabías? Porque te conozco. Sí, escondí una botella. Voy a buscarla. Gracias. Okay, you take the nearest one on the left. I'll deal with his friend. Es una mierda. Es lo más bajo de una civilización. Over here.
Okay. Now we need to create a diversion. Well, uh, what do you think? Find another old lady to strangle? That is enough, Arthur. This is a war. Well, if this is a war, then we need to start blowing some stuff up. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. You got any dynamite? Oh, no, we don't need dynamite. We got a furnace and lots of sugar. Sugar? Oh, yeah. No problem. You'll see. Go close the windows and the doors. Go on, quick. Create enough dust. This way should go. All right, head on out and wait for me. I'll get this going.
He'll be fine. I'll get him out of here. You stay here. Take care of these fools a bit. No problem. Go quick. This will give us a chance to get to Hair Cool's port. I'll meet you there. What you ask. It's like I said. Fusa knows who you are and knows the price on your head. It's a big problem. Uh, I see. But if we can silence him, then I can help you escape before anyone has time to get here from America. That way, we all get what we want. We want to get the boat you promised us. And you will. But you have found yourself in the middle of a war, my friend. Fusa has called in the Navy from Cuba. There's no way a boat could live right now. Hercule! Hercule, s'il vous plaît! Vite! Vite! Come. Follow me. Quick! So now we have a real problem. This must be the boat he called in from Cuba. That's a goddamn warship! You kinda have to hand it to this fella. So I guess great minds think alike. So what now? We fight or we win. Any of you boys feel like running? So what do we do? I will go get the cannon ready. Okay, let's get to it. <laughs> <laughs> Cause if we don't, we're gonna die here and now. Okay then. Follow me. 
and use the cannon. You go, Arthur. I'll gladly hold them off this beach a while longer. You sure? Just certain, son. Do you think that cannon will be enough? Only one way to find out. Christ's sake, how many men has Fusar got? That's the problem. It doesn't matter how many we kill. We will have the money to get more. Watch out! Down! We will have to climb up around the side. This way. Let's go and fight for Dutch. Cossack for now. I got him. Let's go. Stay with me out there.
down from here. Come on. Holding up. That was quite some shooting, boys. Thank you. What now? Oh, they'll be back. But I found a boat for you. And he should be arriving on the dock any time now. Great. Micah, go meet with the captain. If he's amenable and discreet, tell him we'll be ready to set sail soon. Bill, come help me collect poor old Javier. Sure. And cool, it was a great pleasure to make your acquaintance.